you know, Trinidad ain't ready for that. I tell you, if you come to Trinidadians and you tell them we open in a Satan club, 95% of the Trinidadians are going to be like, look, get out of here with your Satan club and nobody wants to be in your Satan club because we still have some of that. We live all over the place, but we still have some of that. But I wonder the, the fact that they, people signing up for this thing because if you hear the music, ding, 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 you know, we, after school, Satan Club, they're teaching benevolence, empathy, critical thinking, problem solving. And listen to one of the guys. He said, they, they say they're not talking about Satan. So it's a Satan Club, after school club, but they're not talking about Satan. They're talking about science, right? He said, in their religion, science and reason are, what, are, are the things that are the most valuable. Science and reason. Does that sound a little weird to you? What have we been hearing for the last two years? Trust the science. Yeah? That's what we're hearing for the last two years. You know. Follow the science. Trust the science. And here it is he saying, in their religion, science and reason is what is the most valuable. So they want to teach the children science and critical thinking and all of this. And all of this is approved by the Supreme Court in the United States. I have a little video here. This video is the song. This is one of the theme songs that they're using to bring these children to the, to the class. Listen, I'm telling you, before they even start to play it, it is blood curdling when you hear what they're singing in this song for children with the nice little children beat. But let's play it. Go ahead and roll the video, Nigel. So we understand the world. Satan looks for truth. Let's help him, boys and girls. Everyone is different, and that's okay with Satan. He'll always treat you equal, whether you're black, white, or gay. How is it real? When all is said and done, Satan doesn't actually exist. He's an imaginary friend who can teach us how to live. Yeah. Y'all could believe that we are living in a world where something like this is okay for children. Understand the minds of children. If you are so small, if all of us grew up hearing jingles like this, convincing you that Satan's not an evil guy. He just wants you to learn, right? In fact, he doesn't even exist. Right? It's just really, it's this whole idea. Listen, they are brainwashing the children. And then on top of that, remember, they took the Bible and God out of the schools ages ago. And now the thing that will get more support, because they will be afraid to fight against these people, they will get more support than even when you want to share a scripture, read a Bible verse or something. In schools, they will get that. This is what they are doing to the children now. Satan not evil. And people are buying it because it's not only the children, they want to believe that they are adults in America right now. Well, majority of the people who don't want to follow Christianity, they have convinced themselves that Satan isn't real, hell isn't real. And here, and here they put it in. And by the way, there is no hell. If you don't believe there's any hell, then you live in any hole. Listen, this wasn't even a part of the Bible study. Somebody sent me this just as I was looking to get ready to come for Bible study. And I was like, my eyes opened big. I was like, what, what am I hearing? What is this jingle? And the, the one that they showed, sent me showed you the people from the, 
satanic group saying that um you know we just want to be constructive and we just want to help the church